They were interested in understanding why people who use it are not as discomforted as using a more conventional hammer. We did something that only our lab has the capability of doing, and that is look at the muscle using MRI. We are able to look at the muscles in the arm before hammering and then immediately after to see if there is any edema or swelling of the muscle. We found that there was some edema or accumulation of water in the muscle for conventional hammers, but when our participants used the shock control hammer. There was less swelling in the arm and it was a significant reduction. <laughs>